It's so hard to make a part over here because I don't have no edges. touching too much on the wedding stuff but to sum it all up this wedding stuff has been very stressful planning a wedding in itself is already stressful but planning two weddings is double the stress however i've been saying it's good stress like you know plan a wedding is good stress it'd be different if it was something bad going on but luckily it's good stress uh, i will say i am behind with getting this dress because wedding dresses can take a long time to come in but luckily i've already been to this shop before i already tried to dress on i really do like the dress i am gonna add some stuff to the dress if i go ahead and lock it in today they told me oh i should be good for my wedding day so yeah that's where we are headed and uh yeah wish me luck we're here that dress is cute and I tried it on, but y'all don't talk about me, but like I want a big poofy dress so that way I ain't gotta worry about what my ass look like. Cause if I wear a fitted dress like that, I'm gonna be like, oh, does my ass look flat? I ain't got time for that. We're here. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. I've already been here. All right, y'all. I have paid the deposit on the dress. I paid half on the dress and babe, whoo, hey, y'all, I need to get in the wedding dress business cause baby, I'm speechless. I did do like a lot of thinking and praying over this dress because I was telling myself, it is wild to spend so much money on a dress that you're going to literally wear one time. But I did a lot of searching. I looked at a lot of online places and the dresses, they weren't giving the look that I wanna give for my wedding day. So I just went ahead and just got it. I'm glad I got that out of the way because so many people, I've had coworkers bother me. You got your dress, Morgan, you got your dress. When you get your dress. I literally ran into one of my coworkers while I was out shopping with my mom and she was like, that don't look like a wedding dress. I was like, girl, what are you doing here? But yeah, I'm just glad I got solidified. So now I'll just wait for it to get in. So now we accomplished something today. Thank God. Hey y'all. Okay, it is, dang, what time is it? It's like 7.30 and I'm about to cook. I'm gonna make salmon, grits, and spinach, which I know to y'all is probably a weird combo, but it's about to bust. And the reason I'm about to have grits is, uh, I usually like to have a starch and a vegetable with my meats. So of course I'm gonna have uh, spinach and then, but the only other starch we have is pasta. And I don't really feel like making pasta sauce again, especially cause the pasta sauce I made on I think Sunday had my stomach messed up. So I'm gonna give the pasta to my man cause it didn't mess his stomach up, but I'm gonna make me some grits. So yeah. Danelle is served. Y'all see that? Got the salmon, pasta, and spinach. Salmon, grits, and spinach, baby. Good morning, y'all. Happy Wednesday. So this is day three of my silk press. And baby, as soon as I woke up, all the stuff I had going on in my bonnet, it's all off. So let's see what we're working with. <laughs> oh, I had a scarf and a wrap cap. And them hoes fell off. So let's see if we can make it look pretty. It don't look bad, thankfully. Whew. It's so hard to make a part over here because I don't have no edges. Let me see what I can make shape. How the hell am I supposed to make a part 
And I ain't got no hair to make a part with. Okay, when I brush it, the hair becomes a bit more prominent. There we go. We just gonna do it like that and call it a day. Hey, hey, y'all. I'm home from work. I went to Walmart. If y'all are at Walmart, these sub sandwiches they have, the pre-made ones, they come with the sauce in there and everything. Bussin. Highly recommend if y'all need a quick lunch or something like that. Hey y'all, it's Thursday. Happy Thursday. Hope y'all are doing well, whatever day y'all watch this. Um, today wasn't really a good day. I wish that I could just disappear for a day, but unluckily I can't do that. However, I'ma be thankful. I'ma be practice gratitude. I have a lot to be thankful for. And I'm just gonna try to get some rest this weekend. And I'll be babysitting tomorrow morning, so that'll be fun. That's all I got to say. Dang, not me getting a phone call during my, my gospel session. Decline. That's my jam right there. That is my jam. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Hey, y'all. It's Morgan. It is Friday. It's 12.45 p.m. And I'm about to eat some lunch. I got my, what is this? This is the Crumbs Art collab with, I think, um, Juwaso clothing. Super cute, right? Itachi with locks. But yeah, I'm about to eat some lunch. That sandwich that I told y'all about, yeah. I'm about to tear this up. I'm gonna get some chips with it. You know, it's Friday, it's the weekend. I don't want to hear nothing. Well, it's almost the weekend. You get what I'm saying. So, yeah, let's do this. This what we working with. Y'all, I just slathered that home with some Chick-fil-A sauce. And I got some chips to go with it, baby. Oh, I like my sandwiches real saucy. <laughs> Good morning, everyone, or good afternoon, good evening. It's morning when I'm filming this, so I'm saying good morning. Today just so happens to be my engagement anniversary, so I got engaged one year ago today. We got a full day of stuff planned, but before we get our, our day started, I got to drink some of my raspberry leaf tea. So I've already made my tea. Let's see what the quote is. The heart is a muscle that expands exponentially. So I guess that means that we got a lot of love to give. We are in the car. We are on the way to have lunch. We are hoping to have lunch with uh, Toon's sister-in-law and his nephew. Uh, we're gonna hope that they make it. Um, we're trying out a new place. Excited to try it out. It sounds like an Italian place. But yeah, we got a full day plan. We're about to get lunch. We're gonna go to a paint and sip tonight. I'm really looking forward to that. I don't think I've been to a paint and sip in maybe like a year. So, and this will be the first ever paint and sip that I've ever done with my man. So it's gonna be a great time. I didn't even show y'all my fit. So I got on this sweater from Fashion Nova. Look at the back, baby. I got these jeans from H&M. Shoes from Fashion Nova. Zoom in on the shoes. And then, of course, I got the Telfies. We got mimosas. We starting off with some Brussels sprouts. These look good, golly. It is time for a taste test. I'm just gonna get this little bit right here. Mmm, yummy. Bro, we tore them Brussels sprouts up. 10 out of 10. 
It had this good ass like sweet glaze on it. It had like some little cheese flakes. It had pork belly. These was the best Brussels sprouts I've ever had in my entire life. Do you agree? Yes. <laughs> you were shaking your head. So I couldn't even complain it. So the baby it. is here. <laughs> And there go Joe Shaw. See, he see the camera. He see the camera. And there go Courtney. Say hey, Courtney. All right, so brunch was delicious. I can't remember if I showed y'all what I got, but I got the Italian chicken and waffles, and it came with gravy. It was chef's kiss. And Toon got the salmon, potatoes, and what else? Uh, little green beans some green beans so brunch was bussing 10 out of 10 asparagus Hi. asparagus okay so he got salmon asparagus and potatoes 10 out of 10 highly recommend the mimosas was good the appetizer was good definitely plan on going back and now we're about to head home so that uh courtney and josiah can see our house for the first time I'm looking forward to this. It's our first time doing this Like this, it can just be relaxing, you know. It is, it really is. Don't have to think real hard. Mm -hmm. Yeah.